Hey everybody, Ultimate Oddball here. Today I'm going to discuss a recent study examining gene mutations associated with autism spectrum disorders in humans and those genes affect on nerve cells which affect sensory processing, anxiety, and social difficulties. Researchers utilize gene manipulation to cause these mutations in mice exclusively in the peripheral nervous system, resulting in a variety of autism-like behaviors. I'll be going over the results in detail as well as the implications of the research. Previous studies had found a connection between these gene mutations and problems with synaptic function, which is how nerve cells communicate with each other. Researchers focused on the peripheral nervous system because it relays information related to touch. Many autistic people have sensory issues related to touch, whether it be oversensitivity or undersensitivity. The mice with the ASD-associated mutations showed a heightened level of sensitivity to touch stimuli, as well as an inability to distinguish between textures. Researchers also noted an abnormality in the transmission of the neural impulses associated with touch stimuli. This reflects what many autistic people have expressed and reinforces my belief that autistic people should be consulted by research teams in order to focus their attention on pertinent areas of study, provide information they would otherwise not know, and give feedback on the process throughout its entirety. Another area of focus was anxiety and difficulties with social interaction. Mice were monitored for the amount of time they spent out in the open, as well as how they interacted with mice they hadn't met before. The mice with the gene mutations associated with ASD seem to display a higher level of anxiety in addition to interacting less with other mice. Researcher David Ginty noted that though this gene expression does not correlate directly to anxiety in human beings, it nonetheless reflects, quote, well-established measures of what we consider to be anxiety-like behavior and social interaction deficits, end quote. This study seems to confirm what many autistic people have relayed, which is that sensory processing dysfunction can result in or exacerbate anxiety and social interaction issues. Though the study does not address it, based on my experience and research, this heightened volume at which the neurons relay information extends into many other areas as well, including auditory and other types of sensory input. All of these things interact with each other, along with a variety of issues autistic people commonly face, to make many things more difficult. These issues often vary greatly among autistic people, which is part of why there's a lot of confusion still on the subject and a need for more research. It's important to note that while studies using mice are common, they aren't meant to present a full understanding of the subject. They are a starting point for more thorough studies which examine the results in fuller detail. Moving forward, this would seem to be an area which deserves more examination. Hopefully future studies focus on gaining a better grasp on the interaction between the nervous system and difficulties which autistic people often experience. Well, thanks for tuning in, thanks for coming by, and have a great day. Hey everybody, Ultimate Oddball here. If you want to stay up to date with my videos, click subscribe. I release a new video on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. I do gaming commentary and review, I talk about my experiences on the autism spectrum, and I share my opinions and thoughts on a variety of matters. My hope is that, through my videos, I can help to dispel some of the misinformation, confusion, and negativity people have regarding autism. Thank you for helping me do that by watching these videos.